Hey guys, my name is Shubhrashan Bhaskar and today in this video I'm going to be showing you how to automatically join Zoom meetings with a specific starting time and a specific ending time. That means your system will automatically join a specific Zoom meeting at the starting time that you have mentioned and leave that Zoom meeting at the ending time that you have mentioned. So now without wasting our time, let's get started. For this to actually work, you need PyCharm and Zoom app itself. You need the PyCharm app so that you can run the Python code. If you don't have PyCharm installed, you can go to the video link in the video description and install PyCharm. After doing that, open the Zoom app and click on settings. Now you need to change a few settings in the Zoom app, so go to channels and you need to uncheck the box which asks me to confirm when I'm leaving. Now go to the audio tab and make sure these two boxes are checked uh, which are unchecked by default. Now go to the keyboard shortcuts and you need to change the hotkey for ending the meetings. You need to change it to W. I'll show you later why we are changing this key to W and you need to check the box and close the pop-up window. After doing that you need to open PyCharm once you are done installing. So open PyCharm and then click on new project. You can rename your project anything you want and now make sure you have you're using Python 3.8 instead of Python 3.7 because it only works on python 3.8 and now click on the create project button right there once your project has been created you will get this main.python file now you need to remove everything inside it so select all and remove it once you're done with that right click on your python project go to new and create another python file and re rename it as data.python after doing that you will have these two python files and all we need is a code inside it so go to the github link provided in the video description and there you will see these two files which is main.python and data.python so you have to select main.python copy the code inside it and paste it in your pycharm window you need to do the same for data python file as well so copy the code and paste it in the data python file now as you can see from the code that uh, we are using py input uh, installer package and you need to install this installer package so that you can run this code so you need to go to settings go to project and then click on python interpreter click on this part plus icon right here and then select the py input and then click on install package once you are done installing the py input package you can simply close the window click hit ok now as uh, if you will go down in the code you will see that uh, there is a w written inside the code that means the w hotkey will be pressed automatically at the ending time so that you can leave the meeting that's why we change it in the zoom app to end a uh, meeting now we need to do some changes in the data python file as well you can add any number of entries you want you just have to end the entry with a comma like this so the first link is the zoom meeting link the next entry is the starting time that you will enter and the next entry is the ending time that you will enter as well so for now i'm gonna enter a zoom meeting link of my own so you can i can simply copy it paste it in place of the link so it's 1536 that means 336 so i will simply write 337 to join the meeting and I will leave the meeting at 1538 like this okay so once you're done with that you can go to the main Python file and click on the play button right there now we need to wait uh, when the time here timer hits 1537 so that my computer will automatically join that specific zoom meeting as you can see my system hits the timer 1537 and my computer automatically launches the zoom link and now my zoom app and you can see i'm inside the zoom meeting with my microphone unmuted uh, so in this way you can simply automatically join a zoom meeting and uh, you must have noticed that i entered the ending time as 1538 so i'm gonna wait till 1538 so that uh, i can check whether my system automatically leaves the zoom meeting at the specific giving time so let's wait So as you can see my timer hits 1538 in my system and my system automatically leaves the jo uh, zoom meeting at the specific given end time. So in this way you can add a number of entries, a number of zoom meeting links in the data python file. You can specify a starting time as uh, specify an ending time as well. I just have to separate the entries with a comma and that's it. So that's it for this video guys. I hope you liked it. Please like, comment and share it with your friends. Have fun. Bye bye.